That's when I realized I want to make a difference, change other people's lives, give hope even for a moment, use my name for good, and change the game I could. Welcome back to Mommy Medley. And today I wanted to share with you all something new that I just started, and that is freezer meal cooking. I have the toughest time putting together meals for dinner and thinking of new ideas, new recipes, and so I really wanted to take a day and just do a lot of meal prep, and so um, I posted it on my Facebook, and a few of my friends decided to join me. So we did... Um, from 2 p.m. until 7 p.m. on a Sunday is what it took them. Now, I was still working for a couple more hours after that because I, I don't know if it's just because it was my house, so I was sidetracked doing other things. There was other things that came up um, that was taking my attention, but it took me a little bit longer. So, yeah, about five to seven hours of meal prep is what we did, and we made five meals. And um, I'll be showing you some of the footage and some of the video, as well as telling you um, if I like some of the recipes. So all right, I did. Got all my ingredients. Well, most of my ingredients for my freezer shopping. Um, I have to go back and get a few rotisserie chickens because I choose. I want to do the rotisserie chickens instead of the um instead of cooking the chicken and all of that First of all, i found all of these recipes on pinterest and i put together a facebook group so that we could all um, communicate and we all came up with ideas and put it on our pinterest board that was a joined pinterest board and then once we came up with the ideas then i made a poll on facebook and with that poll we voted and i ended up going with the top five recipes on there um, it was my first time, so I definitely think that I'll be doing things a little bit differently next time, but I feel like it went fairly smoothly for it being my first time, um, hosting, planning, doing all of that. I had all the recipes printed out for everyone, and I put together the grocery list so that everyone could buy their ingredients before, um, started off with six or seven people, and there was only three of us in the end, but that's kind of how it goes, um, We'll see what happens next time. I really feel like that was probably perfect for my kitchen anyway. If it gets any larger on the next round, I plan on renting a clubhouse. We made creamy chicken enchiladas, meatball soup. We made a um, chicken broccoli bake and a chicken alfredo a spinach chicken alfredo with pesto it looks delicious that's what I'm gonna cook tonight for dinner and then we also made breakfast burritos so um, out of those last night my family had the chicken enchiladas the creamy chicken enchiladas for dinner and I ate the leftovers for lunch today and we really liked it it was um, very delicious so um, definitely get a thumbs up from that uh, stay tuned and I'll show you the footage from that freezer meal cooking, planning, party, and see what you think. If you guys have any awesome recipes that you would like to share with me, please share it below, um, or I'll try to leave a link to um, a Pinterest board where you can pin something that you really like so that I can have some ideas for the next one or techniques, any of that. I mean, I'm so new to this, so I just really would like your input, the input from my YouTube friends and family. Um, but thank you for joining. Thank you for tuning in and stay tuned. Preparing the meals for our freezer meal cooking party. Um, these are just a few of them. I still have a few that I have to print. And once I finish printing them all, I'm putting together the grocery list and just a little list of some of the items that they will need. And I'm hoping that um, they'll be okay with me vlogging our freezer meal cooking stuff. So, um, that's what I've got going on today. I've got to get out in this uh, snowy mess. I'll have to get out and take care of some errands after a while. So, that'll be fun. So, yeah. All the ingredients needed 
onions and meatballs and carrots and broccoli and two packs of tortillas and this is turkey breakfast sausage two packs of Italian cheese two packs of mild cheddar cheese some fully cooked bacon that I'm gonna try to get crispy Parmesan sour cream butter spinach 36 eggs pasta flour Worcestershire Worcestershire sauce however you say that cream of chicken soup pasta sauce um, red peppers, green chilies, coconut milk, crushed tomatoes, two things of chicken broth, one large and one small, and then milk. And we'll be using, we'll be, I'll be using some um, freezer bags, and I'm hoping to find some freezer containers to make the casseroles in. So oh, here we go, here it is. Alrighty, we have been doing meal prep since 2 p.m. and it is 6.15. And there's not mine, this is a friend of mine. Hers is all done. She's still rolling burritos. <laughs> making some breakfast burritos and then so far this is all I have done I have the chicken broccoli casserole and a slow cooker meatball soup did I spell that right that looks like I spelled it wrong it's right <laughs> and then I just finished making chicken enchiladas so I have a messy messy kitchen <laughs> but it's it'll all be worth it and look at my trash it'll all be worth it this week